As I alluded to before, the response rate updated in several studies here in the real world of CAR-T is actually as promising as a clinical trial and that's very encouraging, if both in terms of feasibility and efficacy. Um, toxicity is manageable. You need to have a certified standard that is used for cell therapy and bone marrow transplant. But the, one of the main challenges in the U.S. has been actually the reimbursement. We have a problem with access of CAR T cells. And then we are now moving to we're trying to develop solutions where we have at least the first part as an outpatient because 40% of these patients, particularly with the uh, chemoia, do not need to be admitted versus having to admit patients sooner. So there's definitely issue of reimbursement and cost that will have to be addressed. I am convinced that moving forward, as we accumulate enough experience and um, are able to show the real world cost of CAR T cells, which is about the cost of a kidney transplant for kidney failure in the US, um, would be in the long run actually a valuable tool comparing to multiple treatment that will not have a good outcome anyway.